<laughs> Ew. Yeah. Uh, how do you curb put the rodent little, come? Put those little things on. Yeah, right. Uh, Margaret IEDs. Thatcher. Yeah. Margaret Thatcher. Margaret Thatcher. Margaret Thatcher. <laughs> The New York City Council is set to vote on a bill that aims to introduce rat contraceptives as a new method to control the city's rodent population. If passed, <laughs> the bill would initiate a 12-month pilot program in two selected rat-infested zones to monitor the effectiveness of the contraceptives in reducing rat activity. They're going to open a clinic. Rats are going to be able to come right in the front door, make an appointment, sign the form, yeah. and then, uh, you know, they'll get to work. The initiative has seen this potential um, shift from traditional methods of rat control. Well, they got to do something. Whatever they're doing out there is not working. Yeah. Did he? Right. They could slip and slide all the way into the river. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <clears throat> I got to put that baby oil to use somehow. Somehow. Yeah, I don't know what they're doing with that it. stuff in evidence right Costco now. Costco said we don't even sell that. I mean, just like, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Costco's coming out. When Costco gets involved yeah. in this right? thing. Then, yeah. Where did yeah. you get it? Bulk. City Council member Sean Abro, the bill's sponsor, smart, highlighted that uh, standard mitigation strategies have not been effective overall. Abro has collaborated with Contrapest. <laughs> this is life mission. <laughs> A contraceptive. To make rats sterile. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, it impacts the ovarian function in female rats and Rude. reduces sperm cell production in male rats. Huh. The contraceptive is delivered uh, to the rats in a salty, fat-filled pellet. Ooh, that'll Ooh. get you every time. Every <laughs> time, those arteries. Uh, making it appealing uh, <clears throat> than other method, Making it more appealing than other methods. The bill known as Flacco's Law. What Skinny's Joe Flacco Law. Have yeah, to yeah. This? <laughs> he actually played pretty well. <clears throat> yeah. Del University of Delaware. <laughs> Names Good call, Davey. I, well, you a know, sports ball I know. reference, and Davey got it. I learned it by reading a paper in the urinal. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> you know the thing they have with yeah, the rats. Yeah, it was at caps. Yeah. It aims to be. You should just rolled with it, Davey. Yeah. You just rolled with it, man. <laughs> Too much information. <laughs> Troy was so impressed. I was. Ah. I mean, you could hear it in his voice. So yeah. impressed. <laughs> the, the law aims to mitigate risks with uh, rodenticides. Rodenticides, like pesticides. Oh, I got you. Okay, okay, okay. Which can harm other animal populations, such as birds. The law named after Flacco, a beloved owl from the Central Park Zoo. Oh, yeah. He was a beloved owl. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Seriously, though, he escaped. And then, like, he would, you would just see him around the city, like, standing on buildings. He, he lived for a long time. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Well, he's no longer. He actually uh, flew into a glass uh, window. It was like one of those glass buildings. Like, yeah, that's all. Yeah. yeah, I'm just saying. Yeah, the story just went Flacco. down. That's how he died. Was, was Flacco was an idiot. Yeah. I was happy about flying Flacco until then. I know it's a very sad story. Yeah. Uh, he had a he had rat poison in his blood when he died. Apparently, ooh, yeah. see that's not good. He this was under the pilot program. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see. They say this underscores the need for less harmful rat control methods. What are you going to do? Get the Pied Piper? Like how? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Troy, start playing walk, a flute and walk, walk down the, the street. Yeah. Boop, 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 boop. Such as a push to containerize trash. That's never going to happen in New York. Yeah. <laughs> uh, they say that will enhance the effectiveness of the contraceptive. Previous uh, experiments have shown that trash can be a barrier to the success of contraceptives as rats tend to choose trash over edible contraceptives. <sighs> Kind of like my love life. Yeah. <laughs> Go straight for the trash. Right, every time. By removing and properly containing trash, the likelihood of rats consuming the contraceptive increases, making the program more effective. They're just trying to do anything to, to incentivize picking up the trash off the side of the damn road. They don't know what they're doing. They, they have no idea. They they're have no idea. Scrambling. Yeah. It is pretty gross. <laughs> pretty gross to walk around the streets in New York. It's, it's that lovely smell you get. Each block has a different lovely yeah, really smell. Mm -hmm. Yeah, some of oh. it's urine. Some of it's asparagus. Some of it's rotten food. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, depending on which block you're on, man. True. You're getting a whole different aroma out there. The sweet smell. Urine's involved in almost every block. Though, yeah, right? yeah, It is. There yeah. is a hint of urine in every yeah. block. Yes. Yeah. It's yeah. Delicacy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he had asparagus. <laughs> uh, right. 
All right. I think we should move on. We'll yeah. do that. Yeah. Good call, Troy. <laughs> St. John's County deputies arrested two men in uh, mail theft investigation. Two people. 